Okay, so you guys been in, uh, infected with this. Uh, your personal files are encrypted. It's by Cryptor Bit. You want to get rid of it? I'm going to show you how to get rid of it the easiest and fastest way uh, where you don't have to go into your registry and you don't have to download other malicious software to get rid of it. This will actually only work for 80% of you. If this, doesn't, if this does not work, then you're going to have to go into the registry. So, I'm going to use Google Chrome, and for Firefox and Internet Explorer, I'll put the instructions on the bottom. So, first thing you want to do is you want to go into your control panel, and you want to uninstall anything to do with Cryptor Bit. So, look in here, what you can do is you can type in a Cryptor Bit up here, or you can man up here, you can do a search look for it here or you can do it manually look for here if you find it in here uninstall it okay next thing you want to do and this is for Google Chrome by the way okay like I said Firefox and uh, Internet Explorer will be on the instructions on the bottom in the description okay next thing you want to do first thing of course go to control panel uninstall it second thing is you want to go to your Google Chrome you want to go to your menu toolbar here it's three bars here or it could be a wrench. Click on that, go down to settings. Now in the settings, there's three places you want to look, okay? On startup, appearance, and search. Okay? You want to look through here. Set pages, make sure it's not in here. Anything in here, you want to click the X. Next thing, go to appearance. And some of you guys may have it in here, some may not. Go to appearance. Click on change and make sure there's nothing to have to do with that um, crypto bit. Anything in there, on, up here, or whatever, what you do is you just cancel it out. Then what you want to do is manage search engines as well. Yeah, it's not a search engine, but it can very well be in here too. Go in here. If you find it, highlight it, click the X to delete, and then you click on done down here. Next thing to do same page you want to go to extensions uh, right here extensions it's right under history let me zoom in extensions click on that make sure there is nothing to do with that crypto bit in here if it is you simply click here delete it and that should be it 80 percent of you guys will have this gone forever if not uh, comment on the bottom and there's other ways you can do it so you can go into the registry uh, the Windows system configuration files and other ways thanks